हाय गाइस वेलकम टू कोडा टीजन लैब दिस इज वीडियो नंबर 37 फॉर होटल मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम इन लारावेल इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सेव द वी विल सेव द टेस्टिमोनियल डेटा ओके सो इन द इन द प्रीवियस पेज इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव क्रिएटेड द ऐड फॉर्म फॉर द टेस्टिमोनियल टेस्टिमोनियल सो दैट कस्टमर कैन ऐड द डेटा ओके नाउ इन दिस वीडियो वी विल क्रिएट मॉडल माइग्रेशन so that we can add the so that customer can add the testimonial data okay so let's log in and i will show you so here is the things okay so <clears throat> when click when customer click on this after login then he can see that this is the form now let's create the let's create the data let's create the sorry model and migrations so xam st docs laravel apps to manage and i will create php artisan make model testimonial okay testimonial with migration okay let's create this so it will be created now let's go to let's go to models and we have testimonial model so i think we will not do anything in this model but we will do the things in our migrations file okay so this is the migration and here we will add the first thing we will add customer id and this will be integer okay so this will be customer id okay and now the testimonial will be text okay so this is the testimonial content okay now we will go to migrate this php artisan migrate okay now let's go to uh, let's go to add the logic to the controller so that we can save the uh, testimonial data okay so i will open controller we have created this we are managing this uh, testimonial with the help of a uh, home controller so i will open the home controller here uh, where it is yeah. so here is the home controller and now we will save the testimonial so this is add this is save okay and we can simply we what we will do we can copy the uh, logic from the store so i will just copy okay this is the long content but i will do i will just copy the just a minute i need to sign in this yeah so uh, open our department controller so this is our controller okay let's open the room controller so this is a store i will copy this uh let's go to home and paste it here and this will be we need to import the testimonial model testimonial okay copy paste here and this will be your customer id and we will get this customer id from the login okay so what i will do i will check the session that part, uh, what is the name of the uh, this is the name uh, where it is admin user okay so this is for uh, we should not check this from the admin but we should check this from the customer because we need the customer login okay so where it is check this login here so the customer login data and in this we have data detailed data now what i will do uh, i will go here and paste it here and this will be customer id so i will simply say dollar customer id equal to session customer id login and from this we will get zero and from the zero we will get the id okay so this is the customer id and another thing is let's go to migration another thing is testimonial content content i will say content okay now let's go to our template where it is 
resources views and add testimonial and we will add the name here and this is the save testimonial save testimonial and we need to create the route, related route for this okay so what i will do i will go to who portal manage routes uh, web and uh, here is the add testimonial we will copy this and we will uh, what i will do okay paste it here <clears throat> so this will be save testimonial and it should be what it is yeah fine no problem and uh, home controller we will save this okay so everything is fine now mm, customer save controller everything is fine here is the messages and we are we we need to redirect on the home page okay but not home page actually we will redirect to the redirect to the customer at testimonial page i mean current page okay so data has been added this is the customer id maybe this will create some error but uh, no problem we will see that okay so let's refresh the page and let's add the testimonial and we will we will check this in our php my admin okay so let's let's go to check this and uh, go here so this is these are the testimony while it's loading let's add the data and try to check this this is testimonial save submit this so this is saying that the post method is not supported for this route uh, what it is method post oh my god we should do this one we should mention mention here the post method not the get method okay so these are the testimonials now let's add here something submit so trying to access array of certain value bool okay fine so what i will do here i'll just print the i'll just print the customer session then i will get the value okay so i will just print here so this is saying true okay so why it is saying true we need data okay this should be from the data not from the login so data has been items and we have zero so we can simply add here the data okay now let's check this so this is saying undefined variable request so where is the request oh my god we need to pass here the instance okay so data has been added let's check this refresh data has been added a customer id but why it is not showing the message has error and else let's check this uh, let's say we have if success then we will show the success okay and if error actually we are not say, uh, showing the errors okay but we are only showing the success so what i will do here i will just simply I refresh the page submit this so data has been added but it is showing in the fine so we have simply created the uh, testimonial adding section okay now in the next section or in the next video we will fetch the data in the front end and uh, we will also uh, implement this thing in the admin section okay in the next video okay so let's see in the next video and please don't forget to subscribe and like this video share this channel okay thank you so much for watching this video